Hey there, I'm Dr. Greg Hancock, one of the obstetricians at Stratford General Hospital. And I've been asked to speak on um, the topic of hesitancy to get vaccinated uh, before or during pregnancy. Um, there's a few points uh, I thought would be important on this. And the first one is that we've been using uh, vaccines to um, save lives of moms and babies for um, hundreds of years, 100 years anyway. Um, one that comes to mind is uh, rubella, which almost always causes um, spontaneous abortion early in pregnancy. And so we are all rubella vaccinated as children, or almost all of us. Uh, and it's very important during pregnancy, and that's the main reason. We've also been using immune globulins, RH immune globulins specifically, to save babies' lives for um, decades. The um, initial hesitancy from... Uh, public health towards vaccinating pregnant women was quickly reversed when we were in the startup phase of ramping up in our vaccinations. And this was based on all of the safety that had been seen in countries that were ahead of us in vaccinating and no increased risk to moms or babies during pregnancy or before pregnancy. And um, I think that's really important. I really don't believe that COVID-19 vaccination has anywhere near the risk to a mom or baby that a COVID-19 infection does. It was uh, tough to sit through Zoom meetings with colleagues in Toronto whose ICUs were mostly full with pregnant patients during the third wave and uh, babies were born uh, during ICU stays with moms intubated and uh, the effect of a COVID-19 infection on a pregnant woman that's been vaccinated is much, much less severe. The other thing I thought I'd um, just touch on is the topic of fertility concerns around vaccination. Uh, fertility concerns for moms who wish to get pregnant or people who are pregnant. Um, I've done a bit of reading on uh, where this myth came from, and um, it sounds like it came from a German epidemiologist who had a theory that the spike protein on COVID-19 has a DNA pattern that's similar to a protein um, made by and used in the placenta. Um, it was a nice theory. Another uh, article I read stated that this person was actually an anti-vaxxer epidemiologist who has retracted that statement. It's never been proven and it's never been shown out in uh, all of the use so far of, of COVID-19 vaccines. So uh, I believe that's completely debunked. Uh, I hear it from people in my clinic and I, uh, I don't agree with it. So I really truly believe that vaccination is the way to prevent severe infection and severe infection in a pregnant mom can be much, much worse. Pregnancy predisposes to worse outcomes. Death is one of them, uh, complicated uh, pregnancy and trouble for the baby as well. So I hope you consider vaccination uh, top priority. Thank you for your time.